You really have to be some kind of messed up individual to rob a old person's house, sir. Hello everybody, how are you doing and how is your day been? My name is Stubbers YT and welcome back to the Sims 3 Not So Berry Challenge Part 2 of our Rose Generation. Uh, as you can see, we're getting robbed. Don't worry, he's not going to make it very far because he's going to get through the door and uh, the alarm's going to go off. And uh, apparently, he is not stopped by the alarm. Oh, yes he is. Well, anyways, guys, I did get... Well, oh, oh, little Miss Rosalie is going to go beat him up. Okay. Rosalie's going to beat him up. That That's exactly what it says she's going to do. Oh, and, and Eric is coming down as well. He also wants to fight... Everybody wants to fight this guy. And the cop's here. Okay. <laughs> anyways, as you can see, I gave Kawena and Eric some beautiful new looks. I definitely want didn't want to get, keep Koenna with her bright, bright, bright mint colored hair like she's had before, but I did want to give her, you know, something, right? Like, I mean, she needed a little something. She was looking a little dull. The white just, the white and gray, they just didn't fit her. It, it didn't fit right. It, it was something, it was, it was just wrong, right? I didn't want to do that. I didn't want to have that. You know, while you're awake, Crimson, you can go ahead and go take a shower and Use the bathroom and then go back to sleep. You're not fighting the dude. Okay, there we go. Um, you also can go back to sleep. The cop is handling it. Kawana, go ahead and take your little self back to bed. Rosalie, don't beat him up. Just go to sleep, Rosalie. Well, anyways, my sims are just going to head back to sleep. I have to show it every time I get robbed. It's it's just necessary at this point. Um, is the cop going to do anything with him? Eric just want to fight. This pummeling won't soon be forgotten, especially by the loser. Eric just got into a fight. Oh, and everybody's taking turns. Okay. Unfortunately, it looks like the burglar was able to get away. We'll get him next time. No, they didn't. They're right there. They are literally right there. And they whooped Crimson's ass. Okay, well, apparently my sims are just going to take forever in these fights. Rosalie's going to beat him up, apparently. Okay. 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 Okay, Rosie. Rosie. Rosalie beat his butt. You know, that's cool. Is he gonna leave now? Can you, like, leave, homie? Leave. Get out of my house. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, now I'm gonna send my sims back to bed. Because, you know, they have school and work and stuff in the morning. They don't necessarily need to be awake. Everybody back to bed. You too, Taffy. There she goes. Okay, I'm gonna pick back up in the morning, guys. <laughs> so I'll see you guys in just a second. Okay, guys, we are back. Miss Kawena is having her cake and eating it too, I guess. I don't know what I just dropped on the floor. It may have very well been my phone. Who really knows? Who really cares? So I do have Eric working extremely hard. Um, and if you're wondering why his bar's already up so much, it's because he got called in last night and I had him work hard while he was there last night. And I'm having him work hard now because I really, really, really do want him to reach level 10 so I can have him retire. Because right now, you know, my Sims are not making much. They're making 200 and... Kawena's bringing in $260 a day, basically. Basically, nothing. She basically brings in nothing. Like, that's what it, she brings. She doesn't bring in anything, really. Uh, I don't like that my Sims don't autonomously clean stuff up anymore. Come on, guys. Taffy, eat your food. Uh, around 12, Kawena actually can head out and go to fish. She's teaching people at Sahara Corporate, at the business office, basically, how to fish. I don't know why that that's something that needs to be done, but it is, apparently. So, Miss Kawena, can you recycle for me, please? You're, you're lacking in the recycling department, our yard, our house, because Taffy brings everything in. Oh, yeah, that gravestone is still there. I completely forgot about that headstone being there. Uh, but look, Kawena's little outfits. She's, I, I wouldn't say she's business professional or anything like that, but definitely, like, you can tell that this is a woman that made it to the top of her career. That is definitely, you know, more, I don't want to say, can you go ahead and, can we go ahead and, recycle that one as well. I know it's the current one, but, like, I don't really want it. Oh, Eric is stressed. I'm sorry, buddy. You really have to get this promotion today. We won't have much of another option. 
retired mad scientist. Oh, it's so sad to look at. That makes me so sad to look at. Retired mad scientist. Can I don't I don't want this. I don't want this here. Like I I have no reason to have that. Can I just speed up time a little bit? I know necessarily Rosalie is who I'm currently supposed to be focusing on. But there's not much I can focus on her while she's at school. She does have drama club today. We don't really have enough room for another one. I'm sorry. Do your homework. Yes, Rosalie. She is a workaholic, so it kind of makes sense that that's the kind of thing she wants to do. Please, Eric. Please, I'm begging you. You come home in like 30 some minutes, basically. You need this promotion. I understand you're overworked. You're tired, but there's like a little tippy top of it that's not full yet, and it's really bugging me. Okay, that needs to be a full bar. That This needs to be perfect. Okay, basics of gardening. Cool! Oh, you can help your mom out in the freaking kitchen. That'd be pretty nice. Come on, please, 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 please have the promotion, Eric, please. I'm not seeing a promotion. I'm not seeing it. Yes, he got it. We're not mastering the athletic skill. Screw that. Screw that completely. He is coming home and he is retiring immediately. I don't even care. He's retiring. Eric, you better get on that phone. All I said was that I wanted him to get to the top of the thing. I never said I was going to actually make him work once he got there. No, he is. My boy is retiring immediately and then taking a nice relaxing bubble bath i really want rosalie to get home so i can focus a little bit more on her yes 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 i know it's really sad my sims are both retired busting his hump and raised retired top level completed his lifetime wish as well as a bonus eric is in charge not anymore he retired completed his lifetime wish retired special secret Secretive warrant to go and raid. Eric has a special secretive warrant to go and raid the criminal hideout. Um, you know, he can't actually do that anymore because he's retired, so he's gonna go take a nice, relaxing bubble bath because he has definitely earned it. As long as he's been employed, he definitely deserves it. Field trip to the science lab, cute. Field trip, field trip, field trip, field trip, field trip. And then she's just going to come home instead of going to her after-school activity. Because field trips always seem to fall on days my sims have after-school activities. And I don't like that. But Rosalie is probably going to... I didn't really give Jake um, a makeover. Because I didn't really have a reason to give Jake a makeover. Because she's just going to end up breaking up with him anyways. But I was thinking about this, guys. Right? Once she's an adult, we all know Rosalie is going to become like this super career-oriented... Bay... Like heartbreaking babe like she can't commit to anything what if she has a teen pregnancy i don't i'm not saying i will do it but what if she had a teen pregnancy like i'm not saying now because obviously she like just became a teenager she ages up in 11 days oh my god crimson ages up tomorrow oh my god crimson ages up tomorrow oh that's sad i'm not ready for that I'm not ready for that at all. Oh, my little Crims. Crimsy. No, Crimsy. Crims. Crimson. Well, that's upsetting. Mildly, to say the least. Everybody go eat some leftovers. We have so many leftovers in this fridge at all times. It's not even funny. Um, Steamed veggies. Are you feeling better now after your bubble bath? He's also pretty cute in his outfit as well. Deep fried burrito will work. Rosalie could, in theory, cook, but she's old now. I don't want to make her have to cook anymore. Even though, you know... Did I say Rosalie? Kawinna. Jeez, I'm already calling them by the wrong names. My sims are, like, stuck outside for some reason. Don't know what's going on here. Uh, let me... Really quick. Because everybody's kind of, like, broken. Um, we're just gonna do the good old-fashioned. Reset Sim Koenna Berry. Reset Sim Crimson Berry. Reset Sim Rosalie Berry. Reset 
Sim. Taffy. Fairy. Is she a fairy? Taffy is a Mazza. Taffy Mazza. And then reset Sim. Eric. Barry. There we go. Okay. That should have fixed all of them, in theory. So, uh, can we can we eat the leftovers now? No! She's literally married with two children, one of which is about to be a freaking adult. I don't know what you're thinking, asking her out on a date, because it's not gonna happen, to say the very least. Just the second part- why is there a child? Marta? Hello? Who are you? So I seem to have, like, teens in all of my series- no, I do not. I don't have teens in all my series. There, I have no kids in two series. I, I don't know what I'm on about. But I was thinking about, with Showtime, adding in Raven's younger brother, Phoenix. I don't know, I just feel like adding Phoenix would be, like, a whole new thing, like, opened up and done. Which I think would be pretty cool, but at the same time, I'm like, do I really want to bring Phoenix into that mess? Because Phoenix, last time we saw him, he was just a baby. Last time I saw him, he was a toddler, so I don't actually know what he looks like fully. Um, last time I saw him, he was just a baby, so I really don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> like, what if he just... What if it just doesn't work, right? What if it just makes me sad? Sorry, I'm yachting. I, you guys know, I strictly record at night, right? Like, you guys already know. I am strictly a a nighttime recorder. Recording in the day is just not for me, guys. It's just, I can't get into my groove. I sit there and I try to record in the day and I'm like, mmm, this isn't working. Something feels wrong. I don't really want to be doing this. We're just gonna not. We're just not gonna do that, right? I mean, I try. I do try. You guys can't lie. I have, I have tried. I just, I'm not very good at it. I'm also working currently. I haven't placed it in the world anywhere yet. Oh, because I don't know where I want to put it. But I've been working on building Rosalie a house. And, you know, she has to be, like, something. She's 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 got, like, this big, 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 big job that she needs to have. And I was thinking about putting her house. Because she really only needs two bedrooms. Unless she were to have, like, twins or something. Which I'm really, no. No to the twins. I was thinking there was a lot. I saw it somewhere. I have lost it. Um, was it here? It may have been here. No, it was definitely a lot smaller. Like, it was a lot smaller than our lot that we live on now. I think I was going to bulldoze something. Because I was looking and I was like, I could put it somewhere cute. And I was thinking of doing more of a modern house for Rosalie. I don't know why that's what I'm leading towards. But in the end, I may end up putting it, like, way the heck out of the way. Like, way over here or something. Because I don't use, I don't go over here, like, ever in this game. Um, there's houses, and they're kind of funky colors anyway. This one's just plain weird. Like, I might put it there, honestly. Because it's not a huge lot. But it could also, you know, hold basically anything we needed. Considering she really just needs a two-bedroom house. And I was going to make it super fancy looking. But, but my thing is, each generation, I want to have kind of a different style house. So obviously, Coenna's house is a Tudor. Not a Tudor. It's it's just traditional suburban house. Very basic shape. Very basic insides. Three bedroom. Very nuclear family. Two parents, two kids, one animal. In our case, a dog. And then, you know, downstairs is very open floor plan. But I was thinking with Rosalie's... I'm definitely going to probably go more towards a modern, contemporary-style house. I really don't know yet, but I have been working on it. That is what I can say. I have been working on it. Been working my little butt off on it, actually. Both of you do your homework. And uh, we're going to get a good old dad to clean up. Because what else is Eric going to do? Watch TV with Miss Kawena? No, he's not allowed to do that. He's not allowed... But, yeah, Deathflower. Nice. No, 108,000 lifetime reward points. I may... Okay, hear me out. Hear me out. Because I'm going to be having Rosalie move out, and I'm pretty sure it splits the income whenever you have a Sim move out, 
Um, I was planning on maybe buying the inheritance one good time because it would kind of make sense, right? Like you need a little bit of inheritance. May even have Crimson move out. Crimson might move somewhere on his own as well. But I don't want to leave this house to like nobody, right? Like I want somebody to live here. I just, I don't really know who would live here, but I want someone to stay here. I may even, in honor of their mom, keep Crimson with a mint color theme once he ages up. Like, he does, he dyes his hair to a minty color in honor of their mom. Or he, he just, he does something or another, right? That's a little bit different. But I may pick back up in the morning, guys, so I will see you guys in just a second. Okay guys, I'm back, and for some reason Mr. Crimson has just decided to wake up a little bit early, and I don't really know why, which has made me decide, you know, most of my sims are pretty well rested right now, who's gonna really be bothered if I age Crimson up before he goes to school today, right? Like, as you can clear, well, uh, clearly see, it is his birthday, so you know, I'm just thinking we do a little bit of a Crimson Berry blow out the candles moment. I don't know, I really want you guys to tell me what you think, though, about if maybe I could do, like, I don't really know, because mint and red don't go all that well together, but I don't want to change the color of the house, because he would definitely inherit it. He'd definitely stay here with his parents, obviously. I'm not just going to let some random-ass family live in this house. That is insanity. Never, never in a million years will I ever allow that. Eric is disgusted. Eric, what did you have in your inventory? Deep fried burrito. Clean it up. But I, I, I'm just not going to let that happen. And I'm kind of tired, so I'm trying to like kind of hurry up and finish the video. But also, Crimson aging up will mean, you know, they can finally announce another formal dance to happen for us. For Miss Rosalie to go to. He never got on a roll. But he is a grade A student, meaning I'm going to randomize that trait. Like, there's no tomorrow. Crimson's got a weird variety of traits, to say the least. Um, he's a bot fan. He's easily impressed. He's artistic, and he's friendly. I mean, that's weird enough in itself. But one, two, three. Born salesman. No. One, two, three. Never nude? You know what? We'll take never nude. We'll, we're, we'll go with never nude. I'm perfectly fine with him being a never nude. Um, I, I think it's funny, honestly. Why, why is he already... Oh, oh, okay. So, that's a really interesting question, actually. What does he want to do with his life? Um, I don't really know with Crims. Um, I guess we'll do Star News Anchor for him. I don't really know what else to give him. I mean, it was there, so why not? Um, there's no more option for you to learn how to drive, Crims. You can just drive now. Oh, he's a young adult. How cute. Uh, this car is actually Crimson's. Um, this should be his preferred vehicle. I'm going to leave it in his inventory, though, so nobody else drives it. Obviously, Kawena doesn't have a car. This is technically Eric's car. Kawena has a bike. A little bike. No, Kawena. You're retired, honey. No, Kawena. But there's Mr. Crimson. They don't look that much different from when they're teenagers, but Crimson's always looking angry. Angry little Crimson. Okay. Anyways, look at Rosalie. Honestly. Cute younger sister right here, cheering her older brother on like there's no freaking tomorrow. Anyways, I do think I'm going to end the part here. I know it's a little bit shorter than most of my videos, but... You know, I'm kind of tired and stuff like that. And I didn't mean to, you know, wait for it to get late before I started recording. It just kind of happened. Anyways, as always, if you guys like this video, be sure to give it a big fat thumbs up. If you like my content as a whole, be sure to subscribe. I post new videos every single day. And if you have any suggestions for this series or any of my other series, you can leave them in the comments down below because I do check and read through all of those. But I love you all so very much, and I will see all of you in the next video. Goodbye, guys.